What's up, everybody? Everybody, another reaction today. We're hopping into Gilmore Girls episode number six, season number seven, called Go Bulldogs. Hopefully, it's a good episode. Hope it's a lot of fun. Hopefully, you guys would enjoy the series. If you have, like, comment, subscribe, Patreon for full reaction, uncut episodes. If you want, or if you don't, that's totally cool. Episodes will be here on YouTube whenever they show up. So, previous episode, we had um, it was the Great Stink, which I thought was a very mediocre episode. We had Christopher and Lorelai fighting. Was that also the episode where Logan came to town and Rory was upset because of the way it went down? She thought she had like she thought he would spend more time with her. Maybe I don't know. I can't remember though. I think it was though. Yeah, still not on board with this whole Christopher thingy, but where we're at. So gotta get used to it. So we're gonna hop in here every time. Here we go. Mom, it's me. I just wanted to leave you a message letting you know that unfortunately I will not be able to come by tonight to take a look at your new curtains. Lorelai, it's me. So, sorry I missed you, but I'm sure uh, you're you been <laughs> I'm right here. Hello? <laughs> Hello? 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 Hi, you been? That's weird. I don't know if your machine just cut me off. Something wrong with this phone. My mother country. That's a complicated backstory. I've led a complicated life. Also kind of racist. Of yeah, well, I'm a popular gal. Also, my system <laughs> is, is only open my mail once a month. Your system is to open your mail once a month? Twelve times a year. Provost with mine. Hey, after lunch, can we walk Hunky Dan? You mean Handsome Dan? Well, that's his official mascot name. Hunky Dan is what I call him when we're alone. Mom, I gotta go. <laughs> you know who'd make a great mascot, Paul Anka? Mom. I'm not sure he's the Ivy League type, though. He just hang out. more of a hacky sacky Literally, reading just hang out. kind of place. Mom. Like Reed or Oberlin, where the air is sweet with the scent of patchouli. Mom, I'm not missing the beginning of this. Now, this is my first crop, and I'm just offering free samples to all the local restaurants. Got some eggplant, some zucchini. Some <sighs> she, he's going to oh, like thank this you, more. I, I already have a vegetable supplier. Well, you know, technically, tomatoes are a fruit. Ah, fair point. There's autumnal foliage, and then there's autumnal foliage. It's over the top, people. You're on to them. Hey, you think they really are, are just completely now. separating uh, these two. Yes, Lorelai and Duke. Yale is smart. Yale is you could Yale tell the showrunner just did not Yale. like them together. Hello. Hi. Let me ask you something. Hey. What? What is with your name tag? What do you mean? It's in the middle of your chest. So? Don't hate. So, you're supposed to wear it off to the side. Who wears the name tag in the middle Look of the chest? Look where yours is. Superman's S? That was not a name tag. That was an emblem. So this is my emblem. <laughs> Hello, I'm Rory Gilmore's dad. Christopher is your emblem? Yes. Yes, it is. I'm going to have to ask you to walk 15 feet in front of me. Look what yours is. It says Zinth or whatever the hell. Is this a love interest forming? Yeah. I'm having a little trouble getting deep breaths over here. You're doing fine, Ronald. Over here, I'll show you. Oh, you know, Ethan really is an incredible journalist. He wrote this editorial for his high school paper, arguing that it should be legal to burn the American flag. You're the in. Insightful as hell. I'd be glad to email you a copy if you want. You're Where looking for you're looking for an in. Dying to meet the provost. Sorry if I was being a bit pushy. No, please, you're a proud dad. Wife. Oh, I didn't say that you were. I was talking about his wife, Mrs. Gilmore. She's over there by the. Oh my place. God, Emily's here. Why is Emily here? Oh, I'm sorry. Why is you Emily see? here? I'm gonna go talk to Mrs. Gilmore. Which lectures are you guys gonna hit? And I said to him, they've tenured Bill Sunderland, who's next, Carmen Electra. I mean, I guess you did, kind of, you did help her. <laughs> Good one, Mom. At the end, Bill. Lorelai, uh, if you'll excuse us. <laughs> Lorelai. How's Rory a senior? My goodness, what on earth are you doing here? What am I Susan, doing here? Well, I think the question is, what are you doing here? It's the old parents' weekend. Yes, but you are not a parent. I still can't believe you're here. Mother, it's a parents' weekend. I'm a parent, that's why I'm well, we here. We met Rory. A she was a ninth grader, a tenth grader. Right, a grandparent, not a parent. A grandparent is a type of parent. No, it's not. A grand piano is a type of piano, is it not? Yes. Well, you got me there, Riddler, but uh, I hope that logic still works when I crash uh, Grandparents Weekend. Oh, please, Lorelai. Your father and I have been attending Rory's Parents Weekends here at Yale since her freshman year. It's oh, shit. Oh, hello, Rachel. I'll see you at the field hockey game. It's one of your little traditions to pretend yeah. to be Rory's parents. Responsibility for Rory's tuition. Yes, I remember. And also, so you know. Someone ought to attend for Rory's. Yeah. Thing. Obviously not your you didn't. Thing. You didn't That's attend. You, you never came. Well, it's the I'm fourth year of this. Thank you, me too. What's that supposed to mean? You Four years like of this, kinds of things, and you things never came. And schedules and name tags. You mock these kinds of things. Well, I'm here. I'm not mocking. I'm brunching. My thing is the cosmological constant. Excellent question. 
uh, more thorough measurement not, from observatories on the ground. He's not being funny, Lorelai. Space telescope. Why is she laughing? What the fuck? He's like making ratatouille anyway. Excuse me. Perfectly good vegetables, and I was making ratatouille. It's too easy. Well, it's not luck yet, Ferris. Okay, AK, you're gonna take care of that lacrosse caption. Christopher's really proud of her. Well, you might want to save the metaphors in the literature. Hey, it's um. Ah, oh, Danny. Is it Danny Pooty Putty? That guy's name. It's the guy from Community. Yeah, I love that. It's not bad. She's like a dictator, only cute and nonviolent, and instead of a country, she has a newspaper. Yale lacrosse team sticks it to Ivy League rivals. Done. Okay, so AK will take. might have plans. None. There is a shocker. I'm starving. Well, all right then. All right. Well, on Rory's dad. Yes, he's rich, rich. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. He wants to make up for everything. This is awesome. Ah, uh, thank you. The wine is wonderful. I'm so glad. Wait, I thought she was. Why, sorry. Sorry, this lunch is weird. No, Rory. Okay, this lunch is weird. Why? He's trying. No parents of your. Dad is trying kind of hard. Yeah. He's trying hard. He's gonna start juggling plates. Oh, hey. Yeah, but it's sweet. This is gonna help. Seriously, wherever you guys get a three-day weekend, you should totally come up. Can we rent skis there? Sure, I can lend you a pair. We'll have you. Can get him down there. Actually, get Samantha down there too. I want so many photos of this thing. I can make a flip book. Bill and AK get back to the office so you can prove the stories. I want to hear how he feels. Hope we get to hear. And our cognac. I have yet to taste the sweet nectar of creme brulee. This is going to be our front page. Front page? Really? I think the front page is fine as it is. <laughs> yeah. Come on, we all know these rabble rousers are just looking for attention. Why indulge them? Let's go. I want to go. I want to report the waitress will be right with you. Thank you. Oh no. Come sit with me. There? Yeah. It's cozier. <gasps> That's fucking weird. So far away. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done this. We both sat on the same side of the table. This wow. is odd know, to me. Right? You have to look to the side to talk. Across. Vegan doesn't just mean vegetarian. No, no, no. Mm. Then married to you. Oh yeah, sure. Yeah. My last no. boyfriend, uh -huh. the axe. Okay, you're He's always calling me Marley. Yeah. Oh, no. The I fuck is happening? Oh, Laura's father. No, I don't think I do. Why'd you go the axe? Together for four months. Like. And then he just went totally psycho. I right, man, I wonder why. I What's happening? I wasn't gonna date any more single dads after that, but here I am. <sighs> You hooked me. Mm. The fact that an ambulance is parked by the side of the field before the game even started. They were doing dinner with her. I thought Rory was doing dinner with her grandparents. <laughs> I can't believe we fought. It was so violent. I guess they were just violenter. Uh, it's Rory. They're at the paper. They're still working. Man. Half of them. And that's great, but Rory, Rory's grown up. I missed it. You didn't miss it. She's, She's a dead. College, Laura. We have you missed years a lot. Of parenting ahead. She is due for a quarter life crisis. All those years of stability do not bode well. We're going to have plenty to do. Yeah. Yeah. And the best part is to get to deal with it together. Yeah. Oh, so this is just this is just this is just happening. Okay, cool. They're just wildly out of control. This is the it. she's gonna marry Christopher, be with him forever and ever, and Luke was nothing. For... Hey, the thing we were looking for. It's true, it even surpasses my mother's, and that woman made ratatouille for a living. Well done, super. Uh oh, I had a feeling. It's just ratatouille, okay? Now go get back to work. Come on, come on, come on, come on. What, what is ratatouille like a pasta? Hey. hey! You ready to go? Freddy, Freddy! Just drop the kids off at the Bostics? They made me take my shoes off again. They make everybody take off their shoes. I can't remember the last time I. That is a bonus, but still. I know. I'll get my purse. He's gonna taste the ratatouille, and he's gonna know it's not from his vegetables. What's ratatouille? I thought ratatouille was like a no. pasta. What? Ooh. I can keep my shoes on. Unless this rose is selling on Japanese, I think we're good. <laughs> oh man, he didn't get to taste it. Well, that was an awful date with a crazy lady. <laughs> He's such a dumb. <laughs> this dumbass is gonna leave his girl like a straight moron. Happening. 
reservations at Shays Inn just then. Where's the grandma? And I told grandma and grandpa that I couldn't make it, but I think I accidentally told them that you guys were free. What? what? You were mad. Isn't that a coincidence? <laughs> they had a reservation there too. Oh, don't eat that donut, because I hear they have a creme brulee that is. Don't. <laughs> Come on, get your lame old parents out the door. You don't want what to are the, the people that are there? Bye. You're gonna Bye. walk Bye. in and they're gonna be like, "You were just here. <laughs> you guys are back." All right, episode six, Go Bulldogs. An episode that had potential to be so much more than it was. It was a fine episode, fine episode. But it had the potential to be really, really good. Like, they could have done something with this, and they chose not to. They could have made it really deep. They really didn't. They didn't layer it. They could have made it deep with Suki and Jackson, and they didn't go that route. They could have made it really deep with Christopher, and they kind of started to with his feelings, but they needed to dive more into that, into him not being there for Rory, right? Because like I feel like he's never really gotten to feel bad, or like we've never gotten to see him really soak in the missing out really too often and i would love to have seen that be like damn i did miss out on my daughter's everything i should have been here for that i should have been here for this like like that's stuff i would have wanted to see overall i thought the episode was pretty all right seeing rory in her element seeing christopher see her in her element was fine and um thought it was solid um seeing uh the you know how emily and richard went there i didn't like how i didn't like how um how uh, Lorelai was at that at the teacher thing, and how Christopher was really into it, and she was kind of making fun of. Like, I wanted more of that, like him being like, "I'm trying to pay attention" or something. Like, everything can't be this goofy stuff, and she always is that way. And I don't know. I just felt like that would have been a good place to kind of like stop laughing, stop making fun. Like, we're I'm trying to be listening here. I'm trying to pay attention. This is something important to Rory. I don't know. I would have done something with that story. Like, she got mad at Emily and, and Richard for going to this parent-teacher thing when she never went. She never went. So, I don't know. But overall, solid episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Gonna get out of here.